Hello there. I thought we would talk about a series on BBC iPlayer. It's been out for a while now. It was called Wreck. Uh, this is about a young guy who goes on a cruise ship to try and work out what's happened to his sister who disappeared from there previously. Uh, well, you're introduced to this um, strange cast of characters and there is a killer who dresses up in a a duck outfit like the mascot of the um, kids club on the boat and seems to be bumping people off but the series has a grimy feel to it but it's obviously not got a mega budget but the fact that they have to make the most they can with uh, sort of corridors on the uh, staff quarters of this um, cruise ship and the sort of fluorescent lighting and all of that I think just adds to its texture I'm not saying it makes it brilliant, I'm not saying that, but it, it's entirely watchable, it's fun, I really um, enjoyed it. I'm not going to say it's something I'll go back and rewatch, but it's something that I watched and I thought, okay, yeah, do you know what, everyone's trying in this and everyone's doing what they can with what they've got. Uh, the plot evolves into something a bit more ridiculous uh, by about three quarters of the way through, um, and whether you want to stomach that plot development or not I don't know I, I think you just have to either go with it or not if you don't go with it then that's fine but you know it's just, it's just what it is um, people don't necessarily make intelligent choices or do realistic things in it but let's like say it was an entertaining um, an entertaining watch uh, it is left open ended for a follow up series don't think it needs it I would have rather they just closed it down after the one series but I suppose writers have this prerogative to to leave things open-ended so they can get another job after it if people like it. I can't imagine it will come back for a second series. But it's certainly worth checking out if you want some light horror um, slasher style entertainment um, on your BBC iPlayer for free. Let me know what you think about it. Thanks for watching.